Kathy with us on the cafe. The Wests are back again, returning to our screens on Sunday evening. The second series of the prequel to Outrageous Fortune, Westside, has returned. With us is the star of the show, David Delator, who plays young Ted West. Welcome, David. Thank you very much. Thanks for having me. So this time you've moved on from last season, which was in the 70s, and you were into the 80s. Quite a different feel, isn't it? Yeah, it is a different feel. Yeah, last year we were one, one episode. Each episode was a different year in the 70s. So we went from 74 to 79. And this year, luckily, they've slowed down the ageing process just a little <laughs> and we're just sticking around in 1981, so, which is a really interesting year in New Zealand's history, actually. Yes, it is, and I, lo I just love the show, by the way. Thank you. Um, I really thoroughly enjoyed it. And for those of you that have not seen it, uh, we're going to give you a little sneak preview of what is coming up very soon, because the Springbok Tour does feature very heavily. Uh, so take a look at this. Ah, the rugby again. But it isn't about the rugby. <laughs> isn't it? No, it isn't. It's Well, it took you so long. Ted's on about the tour again. Hey, did I tell you my cousin got me a ticket to the Waikato again? It's going to be grouse. I wash my hands of the lot of you. Look at that amazing car. The great, eh? You know, the great thing about this show is that I've got a car, um, a, 70, a 74 Holden Kingswood, and it's an we extra. We used it. Well, yeah, yeah, well, yeah we had it, right? It's yeah, on yeah. the side of the road. Yeah. It'll be, it's like, a, it's like a, you know, a special extra is parked on the side of the road somewhere. You've got to watch Those it are it. important, those ones, though, because we had them sort of down the road, and you've got to sort of cover up the things that give it away that it's not 1981. Like the I, rust. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Use the rust to cover things up. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. So the 80s, quite a reckless time in New Zealand. What do you think has been your biggest observation from filming this? Have we changed much? Yeah, I mean, I think the big one for us, the getting into the, the mindset, especially when we're going into the 70s as well, was that whole, you know, you have a party and, and the guys are out the back doing the barbie and, and the women are upstairs doing chatting and, you, and it's, it was so separate. Mm. It was so, um, yeah, segregated, the, the men and the women. It's not like that as much anymore. I so think you'll probably find there are some parties around New Zealand. <laughs> I really, you definitely will. Yeah. When you started this character, had you seen Outrageous Fortune? Were you familiar with Ted West? Yeah, I was. I'd kind of been in and out of the country while it was going on, so I'd, I'd come in and seen bits and, and knew people, and I knew Tony from from back then as well. So, um, but when I got the role, I, I then binged watched the entire um, six seasons of, of Outrageous, so just to get an idea of what what uh, Frank Whitten did with the role, and it was yeah a little bit nerve wracking because he did it <laughs> did it very well. He did, and he certainly yeah. passed away. It was he yeah. did a wonderful job, didn't he? So you've taken bits of him into your role as young as young Ted? Yeah, I mean, it was kind of like finding the balance of, of taking little bits that people love from him, but then also it was important to make it my own, otherwise I was just going to be doing a caricature of, of what Frank that. Wooden did. No, and you could never do what he did. It was, it was amazing. So, yeah, just make it my own, I think, was key. And do you, because I know you don't spend a lot of time in New Zealand, but do you watch it, the show when it's finished? Because I know making a show, sometimes it's all pieced together and you yeah. don't see the final product. Do you watch it when you yeah, go home? I, I do, yeah, I really like to. I get a link, try and get them to send me a link when uh, when, when it's been on air so I can have a watch. And yeah, I like, I like seeing it all together. It's amazing to see you know, from the page, the first time you read it, to, to what comes up on screen. It's amazing. And we've got such an incredible team of people that, you know, the, the wardrobe, the hair, the makeup, the someone getting all the cars, like you said, the, the art department. It, um, it's oh, incredible. the clothes. The clothes Yeah, well. yeah, it's amazing. And the whole world that they build, it's really cool to see it on screen. Have you so. kept anything from the, um, from the wardrobe department? Ah, I definitely got rid of the goatee pretty quickly after yeah. I, uh, <laughs> I after, we, yeah, after we finished filming. It's weird how that doesn't quite, quite, doesn't quite work for my, uh, for my current wardrobe. Yeah, it was all right. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see what you're yeah. talking it, about No, it now. worked for Ted West, I thought. I, th I think it's quite cool for Ted West, but it didn't quite work for David. Yeah, so yeah. you're back in the country just for a while just to do some promotion, obviously. Yep. Based in the States now with your partner. Yeah. So what have you been up to? Um, yeah, we've been uh, uh, working hard over there. Lots of auditions around over there, which is nice. And then um, just been making a uh, an interview series over there. There's lots of Kiwis uh, hanging out in LA at the moment. So yeah, it was my girlfriend's idea. She um, sat down with a whole bunch of our friends um, who, are, who are doing really well, people like Antonia Preble who's on West Side, um, Jen Wigmore, Lady Hawk, Rose McIver, Morgana O'Reilly, so a lot of really talented people. Wow, and yeah, um, yeah and those we've did, she did an hour interview and then we chopped them up to, to about seven minutes. And those are up on the Herald website now called Sitting Room Only. So what a cool thing to do. Yeah, it is really cool. It's a beautiful, beautiful little snapshot of, of those people. So. And your girlfriend, she's an actress? Is she? she is. She's in West Side, actually. She's right. in, in West Side season two, yeah. Nice. So she comes in. We've got a, a great guest cast in season two, actually. We've got Dino Gorman in there, Stelios Yakmas. Uh, Joel Tobek's back, so we've got some 
some really talented Kiwi actors all in there. Oh, which is great. fantastic. And this is also part of the reason why I love watching these sort of mm. shows, seeing the people that you know and love and the cars. And yeah. 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 Really right. looking forward to seeing what happens with Ted West and the family. Yeah. David, it's been a pleasure having you in the studio. Thanks for having me, guys. Thanks I for stopping it. by. Uh, make sure you, you sure that you catch the new series of Westside 8.30 Sundays on TV3.